So what do you want to watch? Mm, I don't know, Mike Myers? Sure. <laughs> What, are you scared or something? What? No? The fuck? Well, if you're not scared, then let's go play Bloody Mary. You're dumb and stuff. You think Bloody Mary is real. I don't think it's real, but show me that you don't. <laughs> let's go. Are you ready? Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. I'm gonna use the bathroom actually. Okay. I'm starting the movie without you. Hey, Brittany? Did you blow up the candle? Brittany? Okay, who wants to answer this equation? Gwen? Can I use the restroom? Go ahead. Anyone? Brittany? Yes? You need something? I need you to answer the equation. I didn't even raise my hand. Well, I called on you. Ugh. Just work it out. I am. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. Stop so. Girl, I just found this app called Goth. It's the number one education app in App Store now. It's an AI designed and trained for homework help and can solve all types of homework problems, including those that general AI like GBT can't solve. Even better, you can switch AI models in golf to check if the answer is right. It integrates GBT-40 and Gemini, so you don't need to jump from one to another to check the answer. Here, check it out. That's insane. The answer is X equals 1.5. That's correct. Yeah, be sure to download golf because it also has a back to school giveaway. Brittany, if you get in one more fight in my classroom, you're done for. I'm sorry. What are you doing? Ah! She got her ass. Ah! Oh, Miss Anna, you never bring it up. Turn the pages now and she needs some milk. Try finding a job. Brittany, don't it's worry. Great. There's plenty of jobs out there thanks to the Clean Energy Plan. Yeah, since the Clean Energy Plan was passed in 2022, America has witnessed a clean energy revolution. Literally, in less than two years, it has sparked a clean energy manufacturing renaissance. These investments have created 335,000 new good paying jobs all across the country. Those jobs include new battery jobs, new technology jobs, solar and wind energy jobs, etc. The American Climate Corps will provide paid job training for 20,000 young people and bolster initiatives to expand access to renewable energies and protect natural lands. Did you hear that, Edna? Here's your wig. Not the wig. It's Miss Edna. 20,000 young people, so they're going to employ 50,000 per year by 2031. So you got this, Brittany. No, that's not what we're going to do, Melody. That's exactly what we're going to do. Finally getting fired and we don't have to deal with you anymore? No. <gasps> you're pregnant and you don't know who the baby daddy is. N Wait, you're right. How'd you know? My mom went to school with you. She said you were always for the streets, so it was bound to happen. <laughs> what we are going to talk about is reproductive freedom and how is that What safe? do you mean? If we let it, Donald Trump would ban the right for pregnant people to terminate nationwide, restrict access to birth control, force states to report on women's miscarriages and abortions, in order to arrest doctors and patients. And jeopardize access to fertility treatments like IVF. And that's just the beginning. Project 2025 has plans for widespread surveillance of terminations and medical data. that the extreme Republicans led by Donald Trump are refusing to protect IVF. And I'm all for Americans having a say in what to do with their bodies. If you don't want this to happen, Kamala Harris is the way to vote. Kamala Harris promises that if Congress sends a bill to restore Roe v. Wade and protect reproductive health care nationwide, she will sign it as president. Miss Edna, what is it, Brittany? I was curious if I can get extra credit on this assignment. You wouldn't need extra credit if you paid attention in class. Ooh! 
You're not wrong, so that's why. So why do you think I should give you a chance to get extra credit? Because you said come to you if anyone wants to get their grade up during lunch. And the last person I thought would take that advice would be you. Miss Etna, I'm really trying to turn a new leaf here. And you're making it extremely hard. What is it that you really want to do, Brittany? You know what? Just forget I asked. <laughs> yeah, stay in child's place. Yeah! Brittany, we're having chicken tonight, so have it thawed out by the time I get home. I will. Brittany, I'm home. Where's the chicken? in the belt. Wake up! What? <laughs> Where's she at? <laughs> so guys, we have a new teacher joining our school today. Come on in. Dang, she's fine. You sure she's not a student? Where's your badge? My apologies, I left it up. Yo, that's the hole that fought me in the hallway. And got beat up. I see you already met Brittany. Yes, I have. Well, I'm going to go ahead and let you take over from here. If you have any problems, don't come to me. Oh! You don't work here. I clearly do. Starting today, you don't. I'm going to leave this class and don't look back. I don't know who has you thinking that you're the big bad one for this school. But I'm the picky that's going to put you in your place. I would like to see you try. Let's say some ground rules around here. One, this is my classroom. Two, I don't give two damns if you pass or fail my class. Because at the end of the day, I will still be getting paid. I bet you get paid for other stuff, too. Dang, that teacher's even hotter when oh, she's mad. Yeah. She's just fighting. Oh, world star! Oh, world star! Is the teacher allowed to do that? And three, I don't argue. I fight. Yo, the building's burned. The teacher's still not here. So, Melody. Door is locked and I hear you have a mean kick. Is there anyone in there? No, it's empty. Hi. Yeah. Ah! Oh, I didn't know. To see who's in the restroom, you can follow me on Instagram, link in bio. You can come inside. I didn't expect you guys to move out this far. Had a hard time tracking you guys. I mean, nice floors. <laughs> Does this neighborhood have an HOA? Because this house compared to your last. I'm guessing your mother allowed you guys to get evicted. Honey, if you ever need help. Can we get the hell out of my house? Ah! Let's take the that's the way for you. Ah, I'm calling the cops. Call them, Dean. Call them. You got me elked up in my house. Get off me! Come here. I'm hear me out. 
Okay, everyone, pass up your college papers. Brittany, you didn't write anything here. What did you want to go to college? Maybe it's because she's still in high school. Oh! Ah! Girl, I brought my grades up. I'm definitely passing on all of that. It's just who has time for a student loan debt? Not me. And Miss Edna, I wanted to go to Harvard. Like, I want to become an actor or something, you know? This is actually a good time to listen up. It looks like there'll be student loan debt relief for over 30 million Americans. So Bro, that's insane. It looks like I'm going to college. For those who aren't interested in college, our admin is increasing apprenticeships and trades and good paying jobs that don't require a college degree. Wait, that's so cool. Maybe I'll try construction instead. Yeah, the current administration's clean energy plan has resulted in millions of jobs in manufacturing, administration, and clean energy implantation. Many of which that don't require a college degree, there's something out there for everyone. The fact that they're thinking about raising a federal minimum wage to $15 an hour, hmm, that's something to think about. Yeah, you can head over to American Progress for more about student debt relief or those clean energy jobs that you can snack without a college degree. They'll get you right about what's happening in the economy and how it's affecting students like us. Is no one gonna tell a bitch happy birthday? Like, damn, huh? Brittany, shake your mouth and sit down. Wasn't I already doing that? Today's Tuesday. Yeah! yeah. Now I'm sitting down. Y'all forgot my birthday. Girl, I was waiting for you to sit down. Me too. No, like, y'all was gonna happen to take up as soon as I walked through the door. Like, where's the confetti? Where's the balloons? Where's my money? It could be like a strip club in the tub. Um, girl. You don't got no job. You don't money tap right now. You can't make me a cupcake or nothing? Damn. And that's free. Well, you have to buy the batter, the frosting, and the sprinkles to make a cake. Sarah, you got one more time. We got your cake. I love y'all and everything, but y'all could have waited to sing happy birthday before y'all dug into the cake. Oh! Y'all was that home. Y'all couldn't even wait. Sarah, what's that on your mouth? Huh? Yo, Mel, can I get one? No. What about me? What makes you think I'm going to say yes after saying no to him? <laughs> I don't know my good looks. <laughs> Bro, chill, you're ugly. Dude, your mama didn't say that. Your mama wasn't doing much talking when I saw her, so. Can I get a piece? As much as I think you'd need one, I'd rather not come close. Hey, my boyfriend's breath doesn't stink. Funny. Hey Melody. Sorry, but I'm actually out. Oh. Melody, spit out the gum. That's a warning. Brittany, watch your back. Don't threaten me. I'm always ready. I'm always book. The fuck? Ah! Why did you hit that up? Me? Hey Bestie, what if I came to school pregnant? What would you do? I'd punch you in your stomach. Anyways, no, I'm for real. Wait, are you pregnant? Child, are you listening? I'm hypothetically speaking. Well, if that did happen, the question is, what would you do? Especially if you can't even afford a child. If elected, former President Donald Trump would sign a national ban on termination. Limit our access to basic health care like birth control and contraception, which people use for a variety of health care reasons. See, that's so unfair because I need to have a choice to do what I want since it's my body. We need to protect our reproductive freedom. If elected president, Kamala Harris will enshrine termination rights of Roe v. Wade and make sure Americans have access to necessary life-saving medical procedures. Yes, there's safe ways to do things, but if a mistake happens, we need to have all the options available exactly, for us. Exactly, because we as women all have the right to decide what to do with our bodies, no one else. Why is Brittany sleeping in my class? What's new? Ah! Did she really just do that in her sleep? I think she's pregnant. Wait, who's pregnant? I just ate a bunch of tacos. What if you were pregnant? She wouldn't know the father. You look like I'm too tired to get up right now. But I like to think I know the perfect choice to make at the time ever. Do you even have a choice? It's my body, of course I'll have a choice. No, Donald Trump proudly claims credit for overturning Roe v. Wade and wants to go even further. He's a threat to our fundamental rights and freedoms of elected. He said there should be punishment for women who have terminations and termination bans are a beautiful thing to watch. As on the other hand, Vice President Harris and Governor Wallace trust them to make decisions about their own bodies, knowing politicians 
have no business in the medical exam. Room. Republicans at state and local levels are stripping away reproductive rights across the country. It's crucial to have presidential leadership that believes in women's and Harris hasn't just talked about these issues. She's actively fought for her entire career to protect privacy and medication access. Girl, I don't think she's moving. Girl, she is faking. See? Get up, home. Oh my god, Melody! Y'all doing too much. The girl just failed. Arrest those three girls! Over here! I got you, sweetie. No one's leaving this classroom without getting past to me. Well, what do we do? We jump that You'll be on the cover of every newspaper journal titled Teacher Allowed Her Student to Starve Over a Protein Bar. Be sure to throw the viper away, okay? Of course. For more videos, subscribe to my YouTube channel, link in bio for more. No, you cannot know what type of underground I'm wearing. True! Melody, if you're gonna come to school with sick, you should have stayed at home. You think I wanted to come here in this state? Well, you're here. If I wouldn't have shown up, then there would have been loads of assignments for me to do. And a zero for attendance. If I could take six days off, trust me, I would. You gonna let her talk to you like that? Brittany, why are you instigating? I wanna see Melody ass get in trouble. <laughs> Miss, you have a really smart mouth. Do you know that? If I was dumb, I wouldn't be passing this class. Ooh! Is this school supposed to help you become smarter? OMG! If you didn't know that, you shouldn't be teaching. Okay! Me, her still got beef ball. Why is she eating? I don't need an audience. Oh, we can march your smart ass to the principal. Did the teacher just curse? I will. I will head up there to see if you still have a job after cussing out a school. Look and stop. Stay seated. Thought so. Brittany, what are the rules about drinking in class? Do you think if I knew the rules, we'd be having this conversation? Yes. And why is that? Because you don't follow the rules. And why is that? I'll let Gwen answer it for you since you've gone mute. She doesn't give too much sickles. Gwen is too nice. I don't give She's too much. Step out of my classroom. Don't mind if I do. And I will be calling your mom. Call her! I will wait. And she doesn't so call mother. her. If this is the damn debt collector, I paid my hospital bill last week. It's not Apple. Show. You probably to have one. Ma'am, this is Brittany's teacher. Why the hell is Brittany's teacher calling me at work? Did she not tell you I'm at well, work? Well, ma'am, she. Yeah, my mom told Check her. Out, Brittany. I know you're not causing trouble for the folks at school. I'm not. She Y'all is, ma'am. for another hour. She's your problem, not mine. Feel 3 p.m. But, ma'am. So don't call this number again. How? Oh. You heard her. So in today's 
So in today's So in so in today's lesson we're gonna be learning Britney! What? If you're gonna smack gum in my class, I'm gonna need you to spit it out. That's Sarah smacking the gum, babe. Sweetie, please don't smack the gum. <laughs> I love how she said it politely to her. Anyways, turn the pages. Okay, Sarah. I got this. Wait, I'll stop. Too late for that. Did anyone see me raise my hands? Yeah, no, so I'm not answering. The <laughs> This is an easy question. You should know this one. Ugh. Two. No, it's four. <laughs> uh, man. <laughs> okay, guys, come on now. Stop teasing or I'll be calling on you next. Especially in this day and age. We have to make a change. You know what? You guys are right. Maybe voting is a good thing. And Tiffany, I'm with you on the loan forgiveness because I wouldn't want to be in debt for the rest of my life. I want to graduate college without having to struggle to pay off debt with the career job I worked hard for. I want to use that money for my future. Exactly! And I'm highly against college being so expensive. Wanting to get educated and live a better life shouldn't be running your pockets dry and make your life harder than it needs to be. Education should be free, if not much more affordable. Exactly! Who's sitting in the office is directly related to our futures as students and the future for our country. We have the power to make a change. You're all exactly correct. Your vote is equal to you having your voice and standing up for what's right. And in this day and age, making sure you're ready to cast your vote has never been easier. With another episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Can you put on Zeus Network? I'm trying to watch Baddies. Don't you see I'm watching TV? Mom, Roy wants to show the remote. Roy, give you this and that damn remote. I don't have time to hear arguing. Man, here. Thank you. Even if my name was Natalie Nunny, bitch, you still can't touch me. Mom, whose mochis are these in the fridge? It's mine, but you go ahead and have them. Why are you eating mama's mochis? She said I could have them. And no, you're not getting none. There's not many left. See, at first I wasn't gonna ask for any, but now I want some. Hey mom, Roy won't let me get any of your mochi. Roy, share with your damn sister. Stop! Man, here, just have Ooh. a thing. Okay. I just 
peel myself at this point. I wasn't going to the restroom. Oh, about the same. <laughs> Just kidding. Thanks. Miss Edna, I need help with number two. And not the bathroom number two. Tyrone, that wasn't my first thought. And Melody, if you don't mind having Tyrone. Sure. 25. Yo, Shadi, you not going to show me how to do it. I'm pretty sure that's the only word question on the assignment. And they'll be the same question on the test. Just remember the answer 25. Bet. A few points may be deducted for not showing your work, but hey. What? Melody, I come over there. This Does everyone finally know what yes. to do? Thank you. Doing too much. Cool. Okay, class is about to end. Start passing up your assignment. Did you finish yours? I got all my assistant quiz with. <laughs> Melody, why is only half of this finished? Because I was too busy playing teacher. I'm sorry, she said something. Now I can only give you half the point. All right, I'll speak to the principal to get half of your check for doing your job. How about I just give you the points? I had a bonus as well for stepping out of my student role. If not, I'll take Venmo. Mom? Why are you still in bed? Well, since you don't ever want me going out with my friends, what else can I do? You can clean this house, that's what you can do. Go in there and do the laundry. All done. Brittany! <laughs> Sweep the floor. Isn't that what the robot is doing? <laughs> you want me to tell you again? <sighs> that was done. Brittany. Brittany. Wash the dishes. Clean the fridge too. You miss a spot. I need you to mop the porch too. You mean sweet? No, mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who's there? Since you're already using the restroom, clean it up. Girl, on my way to school and all this week, it feels as if someone's been watching me and I keep hearing voices. Maybe it's all in your head. Girl, maybe. I'm gonna get some water. Do you want anything? I'm okay, thanks. They know you didn't vote. They know you didn't vote. Why didn't you vote? <laughs> Brittany! Why are you in my house, huh? Why are you in my house? Why are you in my house? Pretty sure that's the stalker. Make it make sense. <laughs> Everyone knows you didn't vote. Of course I voted. No, because if you look up didmyfriendsvote.org, your name is clearly not up there. What? Who you vote for is private, but whether or not you vote is public information. Get up my house. But my phone. We need to hold face and vote. Girl, I already voted. Really? Yeah, you have the link to look anyone up at didmyfriendsvote.org. Use it. Mom will be home in any second. So what? I'm not scared. The fuck? Well, you should be because she said, and I quote, if those dishes are not clean when I get home, y'all ass is grand. Well, it's not my day. How about we team up? What do you have in mind? Here. Are you kidding me? I'm home. She's here. Get in position. <laughs>
Hey, Brittany, this juice was in here for like a week already. I'm just gonna take it. Since you're eating my entire kitchen, can you bring my Doritos? trouble too. We'll see. So you better run. Get over here. What's going on? Roy hit me. Now you know better than hit no female. But mom. But nothing. Lay across that couch. Mom, wait. Move on, Brittany. Wait. I miss Taylor. Some of y'all met me the other day. Are you sure you're a teacher? Yes, I'm a teacher. I got my degree. I'm sitting up here and I keep setting up the shit. Work. For real, I'm gonna like this class. I'm gonna like this class. Anyways, we have a new student. Come on in. What's your name? Sarah. Sit next to Sarah. Y'all like y'all be best friends. <laughs> we can be best friends. I just know you're gonna be a handful. Yeah, Girl, I'm look. Like pretty popular. And Beyonce is my godmother. And I'm also about to debut in a K-pop group. That's so cool. And this girl named Brittany, I want to become friends with her because she. Because she's cute. what? Hey, new girl, don't let this whole fool you. She's not popular. She doesn't know Beyonce. And she's definitely not going to debut in a K-pop group. Because that's me. Girl, why did I see Miss Edna sleep on the side of the road on the iTunes? She was what? Yeah, girl, she had a blanket and all in one suitcase. Are you sure Sorry, that was her? That was traffic. Told you. That's probably her second job. Miss a nice haircut. <sighs> Get rid of her class. I can still see your lace front. Yeah! Girls, did you not know this an entire housing crisis? Housing is just so unaffordable nowadays. But get this, the White House released new actions to lower housing costs and increase housing supply for millions of families and hopeful homeowners. So what are the current administration's new plans to lower housing costs and build more affordable housing for American families? The administration plans to repurpose public federal land that is just sitting around to build more affordable, climate resilient housing for working families across the country. Bringing down energy costs, while protecting local lands and water. Yeah, and it says that they also plan on investing $325 million to build over 6,500 units of new affordable housing. If you want this to succeed, call your member of Congress today and ask them to support the White House's new plan on housing for working families. Can you get out of the restroom? You've been in there all day. Fuck. Keep on. I'm going to tell mom your cousin. Tell her. She's not even here. You're doing way too much. you have been there longer than a female. Dang. Ooh. Yeah! Yeah! Boy, let me out! You've been wanting to go in there all day, so there you go. It smells like dust in here. I'm literally gonna pass out. Then pass out. Brittany? Go in there and wash some dishes. Okay. Brittany, you're late. Yo! Where's Gwen and Tiffany? 
they're not don't say it they're not oh no Where are you going? Ah! Ah! I was never here. Yo, you're musty. Ooh! You are smelling yourself, babe. I already took my shower this morning. Nobody saw you take a shower. Actually, no one ever sees you take a shower. Do not play with me. We both know you go days without showering. What's with all this commotion? Brittany's musty. Brittany, get in the shower. You just gonna take his word? I already took- Now. Like I said, I always come shower. Brittany, what are you doing? Showering? Mom, where's my phone? I don't know. I set it right here. Damn it. Where did you last go? In the kitchen? Well, well, I literally just set it down. And I'm pretty sure you actually saw me sit it down because you asked for the time. Hey, Brittany, what time is it? Uh, it's 12 o'clock. Oh, I have to go to the restaurant. You know what? I hit it. Ugh. You be on that phone way too much. Messing up your eyes. <coughs> you need to be up here at the time with family. That's what's up with our generation now. And you ain't gonna find it. Yeah, find better hiding spots.